Well, uh, good morning, good afternoon. Welcome to uh, Music Monday, midday moment number 43, 43 days. Ah, it's crazy. And uh, actually, this is the second, uh, this is the second holiday Monday that we've been through. Victoria so, day. Um, happy Victoria. Happy Victoria Day. <laughs> happy to the Queen. <laughs> um, hey, it's so great to be here together. Um, I, uh, I hope that you've had uh, just a great weekend so far. I know we had a great day yesterday praising the Lord together um, in our services. And, uh, and uh, it's, just, uh, it's just, yeah, great to be able to be here together again. Um, third week in a row. <laughs> Third week in a row, baby Josh. He napped, but he did have a nap, but he's not napping at noon anymore. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, uh, so he's here with us. You'll hear the little peeps, mm-hmm. and uh, that's great. So, um, <laughs> uh, hang on. There we go. Um, uh, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, just Josh is here. Yeah. Ben so doesn't seem to want to join us. Ben's him. okay. He's still watching Toy Story. He watches Toy Story every Monday, in case you're wondering. Big fan of Buzz. <laughs> <laughs> hey, why don't we, uh, why don't we uh, uh, turn our hearts towards the Lord right now? Let me, let me start us off by reading Psalm 33. Shout for joy in the Lord, O you righteous. Praise befits the upright. Give thanks to the Lord with the lyre, or in this case the guitar, let's say. Make melody to him with the harp of ten strings. Sing to him a new song. Play skillfully on the strings with loud shouts. Loud shouts, you hear that? For the word of the Lord is upright, and all his work is done in faithfulness. He loves righteousness and justice. The earth is full of the steadfast love of the Lord. It is so good to, uh, to be able to, to just take a moment in our day and 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 turn our worship towards the living King. So mm-hmm. would, you, uh, would you join us um, in singing with all your heart, with loud shouts uh, to our great God today. Let's sing together.
Amen. What a great way to start our morning. Lifting up a shout of praise to our great God. Hey, you know, uh, I looked over at our little baby in the, in the crib, and he was just, <laughs> he was just dancing away. So I might have. He's quite a dancer, he's a, actually. Well, we'll, we'll, we'll take care of that. <laughs> no, he's a, he's a good little guy. Hey, let's, uh, let's continue uh, singing to our great God today. Are you thirsty? singing where you're at, I'm sure. Well, the, that, uh, I really like that song, and, and uh, it's, uh, it's neat to be able to, uh, to add that little uh, that chorus there as the deer in there, and, and to honor my brothers, Pastor Nick and Dave Hookstein. It's their favorite song of all time, so I, I really love to honor my brothers in playing that song, and I'm sure lots of you love that song as well. It's a great one. 
Well, let's, uh, let's continue praising our great God and, and singing to him this song straight out of Psalm 23. shepherd I shall not want. He makes me lie down in green pastures. He, he leads me beside still waters and he restores my soul. He leads me in paths of righteousness for his name's sake. Even though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil for you are with me. Your rod and your staff, they comfort me. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies, and you anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Surely goodness and mercy. 
mercy shall follow me all the days of my life, and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Isn't that an amazing truth? Because of who God is, not because of anything that we have done, because of who God is, surely goodness, love, and mercy will follow us all of our days. And because of that, because of that, his praise should ever be on our lips. So let's, let's continue praising him with all that we have this morning.
your praise will ever be on my lips ever be on my lips your praise will ever be on my lips ever be on my lips let's pray father thank you for the truths that we have shared in today that you are the God of living waters you you are the God who gives us mercy and goodness and love and father because of all that you have done for us because of who you are our praise it, it needs to always be on our lips uh, sorry your praise father needs to always be on our lips and so, Lord, I pray that, that we, as, as, as children of the living King, we would recognize that truth, that, that you are God, you are good, and everything good in our lives comes from you, mm -hmm. and that our hope is in Christ alone. Mm -hmm. It isn't in our circumstances. It isn't in our bank accounts. It isn't in the things that we think we're good at. It is in Christ alone, and we praise you for that. We pray this in the mighty name of our Jesus. Amen. Well, it's been, uh, it's been great to spend time together again this afternoon. I um, hope you have a great rest of the day. Spend lots of time with family today. And, uh, and come back again tomorrow for Teaching Tuesday with Pastor Kelvin. Uh, we'll see you then. Have a great day.